Welcome back to the channel, helping you earn more, spend less, and invest the difference. Now today we're gonna to be talking about which brokerages are hands down the best options when it comes to your IRA retirement account. Now, when it comes to retirement accounts, most brokerages are essentially all the same thing. Let's think about it. Most brokerages eliminated trade fees like 20 years ago. Virtually all of them have things like fractional shares and automatic dividend drip reinvesting, all the things that we really care about as investors. So what makes some brokerages better for your IRA than others? Well, I mean, you could argue that some brokerages have built in analytics and market research options. And while that was a great feature back in the 1990s, I don't really view that as a feature anymore since there are literally tens of thousands of websites that offer in-depth market research with a quick Google search. Additionally, many of the fancier investing options such as margin accounts, collateralized loans, or naked calls aren't permitted in IRA retirement accounts due to the IRS's regulations of what you can and can't do inside of these accounts. That's because these trading strategies tend to carry significantly higher risk and your retirement account is supposed to actually help you save for retirement, not be a tax shelter for your risky speculative investing strategy. So if all brokerage accounts are pretty much the same when it comes to retirement accounts, what are some key unique features to actually make a few of them stand out from the crowd? Well, first up is the brokerage account Robinhood. The Robinhood app has a sleek design and intuitive interface that has drawn considerable attention, especially for the, the younger generations. Now, for a long time, Robinhood did not offer retirement accounts, with the first accounts being actually offered in December of 2022. Now, Robinhood offers both traditional and Roth investment options, and a huge distinguishing factor is that Robinhood is the first and only company to offer a matching 1% contribution to your IRA account. Now, matching contributions are relatively common in 401k accounts, but to the best of my knowledge, absolutely nobody besides Robinhood offers any sort of a match or incentive for IRA accounts. Now, a 1% match may not sound like much, but if we assume average rates of return of 10% annually for the stock market, over a traditional 40-year investment period for a retirement account, this tiny extra 1% contribution could mean that you have an additional $26,000 in retirement. So how does the match work? Well, when you deposit money into your retirement account, Robinhood will instantly match and contribute an additional 1% that is available for trade right away. Robinhood classifies this match as interest earned, and therefore it's not subject to IRA contribution limits. For example, in tax year 2023, the maximum IRA contribution for most people is $6,500 annually. This means that Robinhood will instantly deposit 65 extra dollars into your account when you max this out. This means that you can effectively get even more money into your account than the maximum allows. And since it's classified as interest earned and retirement accounts don't pay taxes on interest earned, that means it's essentially free money. The only catch is there are some rules if you try to withdraw or transfer your money prior to having it in this account for at least five years. Now, as long as you're going into this with the intent of investing for the long haul, then you're going to be all right and you don't have to worry about these withdrawal limits or anything like that. For those of you that are interested in opening a Robinhood account, I'll have a link down below where you can get some free stocks when you open and fund an account. Up next on the list is Merrill from Bank of America. Now, the interesting thing about this is that the more combined money that you have with Merrill and Bank of America, it puts you into a higher rewards tier for a variety of things, including better cash back rates on their credit cards, auto and mortgage interest rate reductions, increased savings account rates on your bank accounts, and so much more. Now, there are currently four reward tiers starting at $20,000 invested, 50K, 100K, and a million or more invested. And while this million dollar diamond tier 
is going to be pretty challenging for many people to reach, the rewards for the first three tiers are pretty fantastic, and some of these tiers should be reachable by most people with a little effort and a few years of compound growth under your belt. So right off the bat, let's take a look at their credit cards. Their unlimited cash rewards card offers a flat 1.5% cash back on all purchases, while their custom cash card offers 3% in the category of your choice, 2% on groceries, and then 1% on everything else. However, these rewards get multiplied by 25% if you're in the gold reward tier, 50% for platinum, 75% for platinum honors, which is their $100,000 investment tier. This means that the flat 1.5% cash back effectively turns into a 2.62% unlimited cash back card, which is going to be hands down the best universal cash back credit card on the market. Now, there's currently a variety of different cards like the City Double Cash or the PayPal card that offers 2% cash back, but I don't know of any universal card that has a higher than 2% rate. So this card from Bank of America offering 2.62 would be hands down the best that there is. And that also means that the custom cash card with its 3% category in options such as gas, travel, dining, and more effectively turns that into a 5.25% cashback card. And the 2% groceries turns into 3.5% cashback. So if you just have some money invested in Merrill, these cards instantly become the highest cashback cards on the planet. And they don't have an annual fee. In addition, you would earn rewards such as an additional 20% earned interest on all of your savings account, $600 at closing when you purchase or refinance a mortgage, and a half percent interest rate reduction when you buy a new car. Now, while it may take some time to work your way up these reward tiers, if you're just now starting from scratch, but the good news is if you already have an IRA, you can perform what's known as a rollover and transfer those funds into a brokerage account with Merrill. In fact, Merrill is currently offering up to a $600 bonus if you do just that. You take your money from an existing IRA brokerage account from somewhere else, and you move those funds over to Merrill. So if you already have some cash invested in an IRA already, you can move it to Merrill, get the bonus, and immediately start getting these higher reward tier bonuses. And the last brokerage account that's worth mentioning is one of my all-time favorites, and that's M1 Finance. When it comes to retirement accounts, M1 isn't going to offer you cash back or rewards rates or anything like that. But what it is going to do is simplify the investing process for casual investors that don't want to spend a bunch of time thinking about finances. So the way it works is you create an account and you immediately specify how you want your money invested into your portfolio. So for example, maybe you want Microsoft to comprise 5% of your portfolio. Maybe Disney is 8% and an index fund be 30%, etc. You build a portfolio such that everything adds up to 100%. But the beauty of it is that you build this portfolio once and that's it. After that, M1 Finance can not only automatically take money out of your bank account each month and transfer it over to M1 Finance, but then once it's inside M1 Finance, it can automatically purchase additional shares of stock according to this predefined plan that you set up. And while that sounds simple, M1 Finance is the only company that I know of that can do this. A lot of companies can automatically take money out of your bank account and transfer it into their fund or whatever, but once it's inside of the fund, then you have to manually log in and manually pick which stocks you want to buy. But with M1 Finance, the whole process is automated start to finish. So you could set it up and then have it take out 100 bucks per month or 500 bucks a month, whatever, and it will automatically get invested month after month, year after year. So you could literally not log into this program for decades at a time and just have it on autopilot and focus on things that are more important in life. Once again, I'll have a referral link to M1 Finance down below. Now, real quick, I should mention that I won't ever talk about a company on this channel that I don't personally use and like. 
None of these companies have sponsored any content on this channel. And I'm not gonna be a sellout and hype out a company just because they offer me a silly $10 referral fee or anything like that. But it is a good way for you to help and show support for the channel if you are already planning on signing up for one of these accounts. Speaking of supporting the channel, if you found this video useful, consider subscribing and leave a comment down below with what your favorite brokerage firm is and why. And as always, I'll see you all again next time. Thanks.